Like my colleagues here, I've been hugely frustrated and angered by the Council's treatment and substandard consultation with this House on the agreement. Parliamentary consultation and consent should not be a retrospective tool. The reciprocity of data protection should be beyond reproach, and the manner in which the agreement has been negotiated and concluded must never be repeated. However, I have been reassured, at least by the United States authorities, and by the multi-layered data protection systems and judicial safeguards that are in place through this interim agreement. So our poor treatment by the Council should not compromise the EU's agreement with the United States or any future agreements on the security of Europe. We are now, President, receiving loads of assurances and promises from the Council and from the Commission. I cannot yet judge whether these answer all the reasonable requirements we have laid down. So, President, in my opinion, we now need some time before proceeding further with our consideration of this vital measure. Thank you, Chairman. On behalf of the EPP group, I'd like to propose to this Assembly that we postpone Mrs. Hennis Plachet's uh, report, send it back to Libe Committee in keeping with the Article 6375 uh, Rules of Procedure. We heard to the Council who would like to have uh, extra time so that uh, they can react to our own uh, points raised regarding this interim agreement. Uh, Uh, President, uh, I'd like to support the EPP's proposal for postponement on the vote. I believe that this is a sensible and rational course of action. The House may have new powers, but we must exercise them in a measured and responsible way. The Council has tried to appease the Parliament, perhaps not sufficiently yet, but they've also apologised for their mistakes during this process. So I think we should now take some time to cooperate and work together on moving forwards and towards a new long-term agreement as well. I believe it's in the best interests of the House's reputation, the future of our international agreements and the security of Europe that we now give ourselves this time. Thank you, President. Thank you. And the result has been rejected. Yeah. The vote is closed, and the result is 378 till 196.